technology is like an ocean. Opportunities are endless. In part one of the video on this topic, we saw that no one is spared from automation and its impacts. In part two, we saw that this phenomena dates back to the start of modern civilization. In part three, we reviewed facts around how the number of jobs in general have been growing, not despite automation, but because of technology and automation. Now, it's time to land this plane and put this whole automation fear in its context. Are you ready? Let's go. So, here is the summary which is very important, hence follow me carefully. It's true that technology impacts jobs, but it's also true that technology creates jobs in grand scheme of things. So these new jobs may be different from what we are used to, but overall opportunities to earn our bread continue to raise. I'm not making this statement based upon my feelings or anyone else's feelings or opinions. These are supported by historical statistics. We have seen them in the previous video. The world is changing, hence technology must advance, else we won't be able to meet what our new way of life demands. In other words, technology advances, automation and AI is a necessary element of our life. It's a friend, not a foe. For example, manufacturing demands in factories are growing significantly, hence production levels are growing, still employing a massive number of humans alongside machines. Now, these growing needs cannot be met with physical labor alone. We need machines, especially smart ones, as we are building right now. Purpose of these smart machines is to ease the lives of factory workers so they can focus on more value-added tasks. And the purpose is not to take away their livelihoods. More people are able to gain access to quality homes. What it means is growing construction demands that cannot be met with manual labor alone. We need machines to work alongside humans in the manufacturing industry. Demand for doctors is growing, given our focus on health span alongside lifespan. This means we need more automation in the healthcare industry to meet growing healthcare needs, not less. These days, more people are traveling compared to the past. This means we need continued automation in the transportation industry. Manual labor alone cannot meet our growing needs. That's the point. Now the population is growing. Types of crimes are changing. We need more automation in the world of security, policing and law enforcement. So our police force can focus on more value add work. So I believe you got the idea. You can talk about every industry in the world, but this is the same story everywhere. But the fact remains, jobs are getting infected, unfortunately. But they're moving elsewhere, not vanishing. That's the whole point. Lost clerical and banking jobs we saw in the past video either moved to a different part of the same organization within the financial services industry or somewhere else. I'm sure the torch lighters that lost jobs due to electricity found jobs in the electricity companies or maybe somewhere else. And I can guarantee you NASA's human computers found jobs you know, uh, within NASA or somewhere else because who can actually lose such a great talent, right? And lastly, my uncle who feared loss of his job never lost it. He was just moved to a different area within the police force because all the modernization and changing economic and social uh, standards and trends call for more police, not less. So, however, it's also true that all of the above are doing something else than what they were used to in their new jobs, which means they must have learned new skills. That is the name of the game. So what you can learn from that? Change is the only constant these days. Anxiety around technology and automation eating our lunch is normal. But remember this, it will provide you with options to eat a different set of dishes altogether for lunch. All you have to do, ensure you diversify your taste and be prepared to eat that new dish. That will be inevitable, so get ready for it. Those that want to eat the same dish, unfortunately, will get, will get impacted. But wait a second. This will even get better. While you are prepared to try new dishes, 
why not choose something that is more delicious and more fulfilling that's not only possible but i would argue you should be constantly updating your palate and be on the lookout for that new exotic dish keep up with technology trends understand these trends you know understand what these trends mean to your life upskill yourself i will try to do my best in keeping you up to date through this channel so please subscribe you have if you have not done so and in case you believe technology is not your cup of tea think twice because no one is tech savvy and no one is tech illiterate i did a separate video on this topic which i encourage you to check out it's interesting but always remember technology is like an ocean and it has something to offer to everyone don't be scared take advantage of this tech ocean whether you float swim sail or just sit on the beach it has something to offer everyone so be at the forefront of technology and rise to brand new heights in the future the opportunities are endless and you can do it yes so good luck with that